What's going on guys? Welcome back to 9x6 Flips. Today I'm going to repair a PSP that's been shorting out. Uh, if you saw my previous video, this is one of the ones that I purchased from the pawn shop. And I'm going to go ahead and fix this one on camera today and see what it does. See if we can get it running. Um, if you're new to the channel, I buy liquidation merchandise, go to pawn shop, flea markets. I buy pretty much whatever I can to resell. And today we're going to show you how to fix this PSP. So I'm going to plug it in real quick. So I've got it plugged in. Bear with me, guys. I've got very little space here. So it turns on and shuts back off. Now, when I take the door, kick it open, and turn it on. You can see it came on. I'm going to show you guys how I fix this. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and disconnect the power. Now what you want to do is get to the back of the console and pop this door open. If you have anything in there, take it out. Alright, now this cage here, this cage needs to come out. In order to get it out, there's these little rubber stoppers right in there and there's another one I don't know how well you can see it but they're right in there so I'm going to take those little rubber stoppers out real quick that way we can get that cage out uh, and they're really tiny I don't know if you guys can see them but there goes one right there let me get that out it's right in there you can see that's already loose. So let's get that guy out. That's the little rubber stopper I'm talking, I'm talking about. Let me see if I can get the other one. It's kind of hard to do with one hand. Just gotta pop this guy out. Come on, little rubber stopper. Get out of there. You can see it's coming out. Alright. loose. Now be very careful with that. There's a little stick in there. Be very careful with that. If that breaks, it won't read the disc. The little rubber stopper seems to have popped out, but it got stuck in there. Oh, popped it out. Alright, now what you're going to want to do is just slide this a little bit to the, to the outside. You can see it already popped off. Slide this one a little bit that way. And then just grab it and slide it back all the way back and there's these little grooves in there that hold you can see them right there they hold the rails same thing on the other side that holds the rail so now that we've got that out of the way let's go ahead and put in our our disc and let's give it power and see what it does pretty sure that'll fix it turned off again. Let's try that again. I don't have a battery in there, so. But there it is. The door's shut. It's picking up the... That's a movie. Let's go ahead and scroll over to the movie section. Let's see. There it is. Now it's picking up the movie. So no more short. And open up the door, close it, and console won't, won't shut off anymore. So that's it guys, that's how you stop the PSP from shorting out. Just remove this little cage here. Adam Sandler, Big Daddy, cool movie. Yeah, just remove this thing out of the way. And if you're having the same issue where it turns on and turns back off when you close the door, that's how to fix it. Alright guys, appreciate you guys watching. Please subscribe to the channel and we'll catch you in the next one.